Hey, what is up everybody? My name is Star Lord and today we're going to be looking at the new 3.00 update for Fortnite's Battle Royale game mode. And specifically in this video, we're going to be looking at the new, um, I guess it's a feature in Battle Royale called Back Blings. A lot of people have been wondering what exactly these are and I actually have some official news from Epic employees um, regarding what they are and how they work. So yeah, very interesting indeed guys. Stay tuned throughout the whole video and also don't forget to leave a like if you do end up enjoying it and if you do, go and subscribe to the channel for more Fortnite videos just like this. Um, okay, so the other day we actually got our first glimpse at what would be coming in the 3.00 patch and one of these things that showed up on um, what we were going to be getting was called back blings and first off, Straight away, I already knew what it was. I was like, yep, yeah, it's going to be something that you put on your back. It's going to be like a little backpack. It can be something like um, maybe some grenades attached to like something uh, near your back, a shield on your back, you know, something like that. And um, surely enough, an Epic employee actually confirmed all of this. And uh, first off, I just kind of want to actually, yeah, use his tweet, I guess, to actually confirm that these are accessories for your back. Um, so one dude here actually tweeted um, and said, "Wonder what uh, I'm wondering what a back blink is. And he tagged in the Epic employee who is Pete Nob. If you guys don't follow him on Twitter, it's worth a follow. And uh, Pete Nob actually replied to him saying, it's an accessory that you wear on your back. It's like a backpack, but it doesn't affect your inventory. And then uh, Reload the Pickle went on to actually, or Roy did Pickle even went on to say, nice, kind of similar to the Raptors backpack. I guess he can't wear one since he already has one. Or will we be able to remove his and put on a new one? By the way, y'all keep up the great effing work, fellas. Love this game, y'all, and the time and effort that is continuously put into it. And uh, Pete actually replied saying, Raptor's backpack becomes an equipable item in your locker in the 3.0 update. You can choose to use this backpack as a back bling or one of the other back blings from the battle pass. Um, and any other back bling from characters that you own. Uh, you can choose to go into battle without back bling. So he kind of summarized a lot of stuff there. He actually, you know, that was, that was pretty good. I'm very grateful that he did that. Um, so basically, like you've just heard right here, um, yes, the Raptor's back bling, or I guess his backpack, will be a toggle, I guess. Now you can actually take it off or keep it on. It's completely up to you. And there's going to be a lot of these in the game. It's specifically in this Season 3 Battle Pass, I'm pretty sure they said there's going to be around about four unlockable back blings. I'm not 100% sure on that, but I definitely know there's more than two. Why they did this? Why did they do this? I, to be honest, guys, a lot of people really love the customization in this game, considering that, like, there's so many characters to choose from. Like, some of them are so fun that people just keep on buying them, you know? Because they are. They're pretty... It's, it's like... Um, it's a bit addicting to actually get the latest skin that's out and obviously Epic made this game for free. They released it for free and they need to make back some money and this was such a great idea to add in a little bit more customization to your character to make it feel like your character. Um, so I am completely backing this. I think it's absolutely amazing that they're doing this. I cannot wait for the endless possibilities of what you can actually put onto your back. First off, just off the top of my head, I already know that there's going to be characters such as um, the ski people, you know, the way you can have like a ski, the skis on your back. Um, so that'll be one that you can equip onto any player. Um, also, I'm assuming that the Cupid's wings uh, from the Valentine's Day pack, they will be unequipable too. So yeah, pretty much you can probably put them on whatever character you want. And um, we've also got the bow that's on the teddy bear's back. We've also got, oh, uh, there's so many. There's actually like so many right now. Uh, there's even like a shield from one of the... Uh, the Black Knight, I believe it is. He has a shield that you can take on and off his back. So there's quite a lot already in the game that they've already introduced us to. It's just that we didn't know that they were going to be adding this into the game, which is pretty interesting. And this just shows you that Epic know that people want to customize their character in many ways. And this will open up a lot of opportunity for a lot more customization features along down the line. And that's kind of what I wanted to make this video about. I wanted to talk about that because... It's pretty interesting to speculate, you know? If you guys have any kind of ideas of what they could add as a customizationable option in the, let's say, for example, 4.0 updates, like, whenever it comes, feel free to comment down below. But personally, I'm thinking that they're gonna, um, 
maybe give you the option to actually unequip helmets and stuff like that. So for example, if you're wearing the Black Knight suit, you can take off the helmet, you know? I think that they're going to do that eventually. And not only that, but I did see a very popular Reddit post about coloring in your own um, clothing. So for example, like, you know, if you didn't want, um, if you didn't want your teddy bear to be pink, you could have it as a blue one. That really struck me. And I was like, that is a really good idea. Epic will most likely hop onto that. I think customization, they understand that people want it and they will pay for it in some cases. So, you know, what's the harm in doing it? So, they're the two main things I'm, go I'm probably seeing in the future, you know, removable helmets or, you know, hats or whatever, you know, and... <laughs> And also, sorry about that, I choked to death on my own cough. Um, and also the fact that you may, in future, be able to actually color in your own clothing to whatever color you want. Like color dye or clothing dye, I guess. Um, but anyway, guys, if you're very excited about the new update that is dropping on the 22nd of February, which is tomorrow, please tell me in the comment section below what you're looking forward to the most. And also, like I said, subscribe to the channel if you did enjoy this video or you just like speculation videos talking about updates and everything like that. I would appreciate it. But uh, yeah, guys, have a very awesome day. Enjoy the new Season 3 update when it comes out. And uh, yeah, until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, see you.